Hi, this is May, and I'm Ursanka from Papa Chicken Boys, and we are in the Beamer's Park and Opening. So we're going inside to see what's going on. Uh, now we're right, you can see the uh, rolling boat, rolling boat, and they will have... Um, and this is uh, the part of uh, parkour so later on they will have um, people who will do a parkour here at the entrance and we can see many people just arriving and enjoying. This park is um, near in Vistabia uh, Station and uh, between Vistabia Station and Marigold Station. So it's really the center of Marigold. And they're doing a But still, there's a part of this um, park not yet done. But I think a few months it will be ready for the people. But actually, what is gonna be over here? Huh? What is gonna be over here? Uh, this part. There are uh, trees. I think they have 100 ah, yeah, trees okay. in there. It's also part of the activities here, the tree planting. So the weather is not good, but there's a lot of people coming here to celebrate this opening. And I hope uh, it will not rain hard. <laughs> Because this is an outdoor activities and uh, it's difficult. Yeah, there's still a big part that's not yet done. So now we are going huh? to the DZ. We're now approaching to the playground where a lot of kids there playing and they have um, like grill, marshmallow grill. I don't know what you do you call it. Well, most of, uh, uh, of the visitors here are kids, actually. If you see that um, the percentage here ranges from uh, like 5 to 13. Kids excited. Yeah. It's a long way to DJ. Well, this is uh, <laughs> how many meters, square meters of park. So there's like a playground. And they are building some bread. Kids are building some bread. <laughs> A lot of activities they can play in the sand, they can have in the what do you call that trampoline. Okay, what happened if that breaks down? <laughs> trampoline, that's trampoline. In spite of uh, not good weather here, kids are enjoying. <laughs> 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 
now we're approaching to the football um, area. Here, they, um, you will see the DJ playing, and I don't know what you call that. I think they call DJ set up. No, this one, the, they're... The basketball side. The left side. Basketball area. But nobody is playing basketball. It's not popular here. We can see that some kids are playing table tennis. Table tennis. And I don't know what you call that. Right? It seems like people are walking on the rope. This is one of the part of the activities here, workshop. They are building house for the birds. Birds, yeah. So they are inviting a lot of partners here to, to help the kids. Okay, there's a um, food setting and for a reasonable price. There's oh, it's difficult to hear a voice because of the music. Yes, DJ. we are now approaching here in the, in the area where the DJ is. It's a football field. Why you getting torn apart? Here comes the rude boys with the lunch of plants. Smith and Wesson, General Rose, and the boot camp. Please give your attraction here. They um, put up a football field here in Nordibro. So uh, later they will have um, a game from Nordibro um, soccer team. Okay, so this is the end of the part, and later on we will um, see the mayor who will do a speech and a lot of um, things going on until six o'clock. So we will, I hope you enjoy the next part of the activity. Thank you for watching. 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 From Copenhagen Boys, and we are here right now at the opening of Mimers Park. And we are uh, we have here one of the visitors here. Hi, sir. Hi. Hello. Hi, uh, sir. What, you, what is your name again? My name is Walter. Yes, and uh, are you having fun in this uh, opening right now? Uh, well, uh, I don't think they have uh, uh, much for me, but uh, I think it is a good offer for the people around here. I think it's a good offer for the people of this community. Okay, so what do you think about this uh, opening of a park in the center of Naruto? Um, it's a um, good idea um, because um, there um, is a lack of resources here. and. Um, as you uh, might know, um, Copenhagen wants uh, to have uh, resourceful people here and uh, uh, to get those people here they need to offer something and uh, this is an offer for the people so that they can have uh, some uh, um, leisure opportunities. So uh, yeah, I think the principle is good idea. And as you uh, still can see, um, actually it, uh, before it was nothing. Uh, it was just uh, a hole in the ground, like a desert uh, in, uh, in the middle of Copenhagen. So uh, um, also that makes it um, um, like, like a sort of a, 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 a attraction here. Yeah. Uh, and you can see that uh, the park is like the offering for the kids and yes. for the teenagers. Yes. What will be the impact of this in the community? Because uh, we know that um, majority living here in Orebro are from other countries. Yes, and, uh, yes, yeah, Asian. yeah, yeah. I think the uh, problem with the people uh, living here is um, that uh, they don't know what to do with their leisure time. So uh, they uh, need to uh, get some stimulation. And uh, I think, or I hope, that um, this part will give them the stimulation so that they know what, what to do um, in their spare time. Okay, so uh, one, one last time. Um, uh, is it uh, timely to, to open a park? right now that uh, the Danish economy is not good, maybe they can uh, give that money to other other um, departments like education or health rather than opening a, a, a park like this. Is it timely or what do you think? Um, you always can ask like that. Um, so um, 
Um, I don't know how much this bond cost it, um, um, and uh, we don't know yet how much will be the benefit. So uh, um, I think it's too early to make a cost-benefit account. Um, I think uh, the benefit will be uh, much better, much higher than the cost ever has been. And um, it's also a, um, the task of the public uh, to, uh, to create work. So uh, um, creating this park also created work. So uh, that is a, a task of, uh, of, of uh, public. Uh, so. Okay, thank yeah. you very much, sir. And we're now going inside to see what's happening. Thank this you. is May Antonka from Copenhagen Voice, and we are signing out.